Premier Planet, it's your favorite MC, JB, Justin Barlow, here with you inside the Premier Studio in Woodstock, Illinois. And I'm here to tell you all about what you missed this last Saturday night at PPW 101 if you weren't here to join us. We started writing that whole new chapter in our legacy. Now that PPW 100 is in the history books, we are so excited to begin this next leg of our journey. And it started tonight, first matchup, we had Ulysses S. Adams coming off of a heartbreaking defeat last week at the hands of the champ, Chase Gosling, in non-title action. He took on the man from deepest, darkest Africa, Kim Chi. Now, Kim Chi, he tried to pull out every trick in the book he could, even using that riding crop that he carries around on a couple of occasions. But Ulysses S. Adams, determined to get that momentum back that he lost last week, delivers a huge leg drop, gets the one, two, three, and walks out with old glory flying high once again. Following that, number one contendership. Matt Vine, the world exclusive, and Scott Colton, the human video game. And whoa, was this one crazy. It was intense. These guys left. Forget leaving nothing to chance. These guys threw caution completely out the window, both just really tasting that title shot. And these guys, I mean, all credit due to both Scott Colton and Matt Vine. They had the crowd on their feet. These guys, pillar to post. I know it's, a, I know it's an old saying, but in this one, it was pretty literal. Pillar to post, these guys went. And it ended up being the human video game Scott Colton seizing that number one contendership. Matt Vine, oh, he came this close to becoming the new number one contender, but to no avail. Scott Colton goes on now to face the champ, and we'll find out who that is a little bit later on. But Matt Vine, both of you guys, just honestly, amazing work. And these two guys, no show of disrespect, complete honor between the two. These guys shook hands, and the Premier Planet just a, a, like a three-way mutual sign of respect between these athletes and the great fans here at Premier Pro Wrestling. Following that, Revenge was the name of the game. Irish Andy Anderson finally gets his hands on Ronnie Metro again after PPW 100, which if you remember, Ronnie Metro made a huge statement by assaulting Premier CEO Randy Ritchie, and then when Andy Anderson comes out to help Randy, he gets himself handcuffed to the bottom rope, and he's forced to look on helplessly, so Andy... Andy did not waste any time. Usually he likes to go around and see the fans. Today, beeline right for the middle of the ring. He gets the jump on Ronnie. Ronnie's caught completely off guard. And for the bulk of the match, Andy really carried this one. Ronnie just, he didn't know where Andy was going to come from next. It seemed like the more Ronnie beat on Andy, the more momentum Andy gained. But then Ronnie, we shouldn't be surprised by this. Ronnie Metro... And Andy Anderson has Ronnie. He just floated over him looking for a sunset flip. The referee, he's behind Ronnie. He doesn't see Ronnie apparently reaching into his trunks. Apparently, he produced some kind of foreign object. He hits Andy in the face, hooks Andy's leg. Ronnie Metro steals one here tonight. And Andy Anderson, oh, he has that chance at revenge just completely ripped away from him. So, you know, poor Andy. He did not get what he came to the Premier Studio for, and Ronnie Metro gets to leave again. He gets to bow out of here with his head held high. And then in our main event, after besting both Matt Vine and Scott Colton at PPW 100 in what was an awe-inspiring triple threat match, Iniestra, Woodstock's favorite son, stepped into the ring to take on the champ, Chase Gosling, with the gold on the line. Now, I think... In this one, from my own perspective, Chase may have underestimated the competition a little bit because from the onset in Yestra, he had Chase's number, it seemed like. Chase, he didn't know where Inyestra was going to come from next. Inyestra had him on the mat. Inyestra was flying all over the ring. These guys, oh man, you want to talk about tearing the house down, a great championship matchup. These guys had one here this evening at Inyestra. Oh, so very close, like a, like a thread, like the width of a thread away from becoming the new PPW World Champion. But as he and Chase are exchanging momentum, trying to get the other one into a backslide, Chase grabs on to a split second opening, and he's able to get Inestra up and down in one of those just, oh, it was, it was 
bone crunching. It hurt to even just hear Iniesta's body hit the mat with this power bomb that Chase Gosling delivered to him. Chase Gosling gets the one, two, three, walks out still, your PPW World Heavyweight Champion, and forcing Iniesta back into the number one contender's picture. But Iniesta, he's going to get another chance at PPW 102 this coming Saturday. And when he faces the runner-up from the number one contender's match at PPW 101, Matt Vine. Meanwhile, Chase Gosling is going to have his hands full when he puts the belt up against the new number one contender, the former champ, the human video game Scott Colton. Also this Saturday, Andy Anderson is going to look to take out a little bit of frustration on Kim Chi, and Ronnie Metro is going to have to go one-on-one -on -one with Ulysses S. Adams, who's now rebuilding momentum after losing to Chase Gosling at PPW 100. Again, Premier Planet, I want to thank you on behalf of all of us here at Premier Pro Wrestling for your continued support. Keep getting the word out there. Keep telling your family and friends about our Facebook page. Remember, we're also on Twitter. We're on YouTube. We're now on Snapchat. And we're also on Instagram. Plenty of great ways to see photos and videos of all the great action here at PPW. Again, that address here is 1230 Davis Road, and we are here each and every Saturday night for, you, for your viewing pleasure. Thank you so much, Premier Planet. Once again, I'm Justin Barlow. It's been my honor being your master of ceremonies here at Premier Pro Wrestling. We'll see you folks out here at 1230 Davis Road.